Now Cameron knows how to hold on to the sword. So knowing how her root runs, I'll attack her root. Hollow out below her. Once you hollow out below her, you can pass in these stick on the tree and she will pump. You'll see where I found the first root. And the first root is right up in here. This is the first one. Once you remove that, she has another one over here, and she has another one there, and the core center is right down there, but that can be easily be broken once I hollow her out. So that's cool. Could be a big one right here from where to the left. Yeah, there she goes. Um, in other words, you can't just pull these suckers out. You have to disable them. Okay, we can go. Okay, this now. See how she holds on. You gotta find these. A lot of times if you take your hook pick and hit the tree, you'll see the ground move and you'll know one is there. So you bust that one. And then when you hit it again, the ground move over here, you bust that one. And you break her down. And when you break her down, you just step on her and bring her down to here. And then the last few holders would be here and to the right. Yeah, this is one right here, and one over here somewhere, it should be, I know, see, there she goes. Once those are taken out, have a machete so I use the best thing I got. One bust. Turn the pick to the, the digging point to find where I want to use where the root exactly is. Then I take the dirt out and I uh, commence busting the root. a wild time tree has a chance against the ghosts from the ocean? <laughs> I don't think so.